Hello everyone, I'm Yan Shen and from School of Health, Shandong University of Traditional Chinese Medicine. The title is Cognitive Differences Between Supervisors and Subordinates in the Context of the Impact of Psychological Contract on Organizational Identification. Mm, background and purpose. Most scholars are interested in fulfillment or violation of psychological contract PC, and a few scholars are interested in uh, different uh, types of PC, include uh, transition, transitional psychological contract PCT, relational psychological contract PCR, and different uh, types of PC provide different uh, psychological business. And most uh, studies on distributive justice, ODJ, they selected data from a single level and they say uh, theoretically deficient. Uh, so this study uh, used the paired uh, sample design and selected data from two levels, supervisors and subordinates. Research questions. One is, how does the process of impact PC on organizational identification, or I, and uh, do supervisors and uh, subordinates uh, cognition of distributive justice, ODG, play the same role. Theoretical basis, the social exchange in organization, first the organizational pay fair treatment, development uh, opportunities, and high quality relationships. And uh, employees return in the way that they can control uh, include the organizational identification, long-term retention, uh, and uh, mutually beneficial relations are uh, uh, established. They seek the balance and uh, transcend the contract. Uh, there are some same points within uh, PC, OJD, and OI. Uh, they all reflect the relationship and based on uh, reciprocity, and uh, they are um, uh, all a form of social exchange. Uh, so, compared with uh, social identity theory, we um, prefer to study uh, based on social exchange theory, SET. Hypothesis. Uh, employees with PCT, they pay attention to um, material rewards and pay no attention to organizational culture and value. Uh, and employees with PCR, the, uh, the social exchange consistent with the emotional aspect uh, uh, other than salary. Their Behaviors and uh, ideas are consistent with the organization. So H1A is PCT negatively um, practice OI and uh, PCR per, um, per, um, positively predict OI. Distributive justice is a core um, element that uh, effect organizational identification, the employees with PCT, in order to avoid a sense of indebtedness and prove worth value, they will be willing to stand on the organizational point of view, and their uh, OR will be improved. And employees with PCR, uh, they expect long-term development and increase uh, confidence in the organization, so they will enhance OI. And um, the second the hypothesis, uh, supervisor uh, uh, subordinates the cognition on distributive um, justice 
weeks, H1A, and will strength H1B. There are two levels of distributive justice. One is objective fact, and the other is perceptual judgment. And they have ambiguity, so it is necessary to investigate objective fact is fair or not. In practice, distribution is always carried out by supervisors. Perhaps supervisors' perception present material distribution according to the contract. When supervisors can say that the distribution is fair, employees with PCT will feel that uh, exchange relations is balanced and will enhance OI. An employee uh, with PCR, uh, they have more trust and uh, reliance on the organization and uh, they will uh, future enhance OI. So hypothesis three, supervisors uh, cognition of distributive justice uh, reduce H1A and uh, intra will entrance H1B. Design and the methods population in the private service oriented SMEs Management designs are strong independence and determine uh, the uh, re remuneration based on the contribution. The levels of employees I are uneven. So the role of social exchange is more immediate and timely. The relationship among PC, OI, ODJ are more immediate, uh, easily observed. Because there are no regionally differences in these characteristics, uh, so we select uh, the administrative staff of the uh, pri private service oriented SMEs as a population from Jinan, Shandong, China. The number of valid questionnaires is 437. Data selection process, um, we selected an administrative team through uh, negotiating with HR and uh, supervisors selected uh, uh, subordinates uh, who worked together for over six months. Uh, they came the same room at the same time. In order to protect the privacy and ensure uh, authenticity, uh, the real name shall not be write down. Supervisors name name the uh, subordinates as A B C D E F, and the subordinates write down the card. But there. Uh, real name. Um, and the supervisors and his subordinates questionnaires are bound together in a book and will be given a number one by one. The numbers conform to a normal distribution. This is the reliabilities. Uh, from CFA test, we found that the fixed indexes uh, fell within an acceptable range. Convergent uh, validities are uh, sufficient for the study. And SME, uh, we found that the indexes fit well.
H2A is supported. Uh, and this is the sample slopes. But H2B and uh, H3A, H3B are all not supported. And this is the full model. Only one is bodied. Main funding. PCT and PCR have different effects on OI, and there are cognitive differences between supervisors and subordinates. The two cognitions of ODJ have different effects. Theoretical contributions. The theoretical basis has been extended, and it is confirmed that paired sample design and uh, collection data from two levels is necessary to study uh, dyadic relationship. Predical, pre, um, pre practical in uh, play Applications. We should pay attention to subordinates' the cognition of ODJ rather than supervisors' own cognition. And the supervisors' cognition of ODJ cannot uh, directly affect uh, subordinates' PC on OI. It only works when subordinates feel distribution is fair. Limitations and uh, uh, future research, um, how supervisors' uh, cognition affect uh, subordinates. And this study failed to compare the influence of background and the culture of the um, enterprises. So few, uh, future research should uh, address these emotions. Thanks.